Areas and how to calculate them. <clears throat> What's area? Hedgebaston Reservoir has a certain area of water available. The shape can be approximated by drawing a polygon. The area can be estimated by counting squares on a grid. Units of area. The units of area is square meters or square centimeters as appropriate. The index of 2 doesn't mean to square the number, it just means the name of the unit. This rectangle has an area of 12 square centimetres because it's 4 by 3 wide and you multiply them. This triangle has an area of 6 square centimetres and it's approximately half the rectangle above. Simple shapes have areas that can be calculated from formulas. For instance, the formula for the rectangle is the area is equal to the length times the breadth, or A equals L times B. So this rectangle has an area of 6 by 3 equals 18 square centimetres. From this shape we can easily build up several more formulas. The parallelogram can be assembled from a rectangle by cutting a small triangle from one end and adding it to the other. No area is lost. It's a bit like a pushed over rectangle. So the formula is similar to the rectangle. Its area equals base times perpendicular height. For this particular parallelogram, the area is 6 times 3 equals 18 square centimetres. Notice that the height must be measured at, at perpendicular to the base. Never use the slant height or length of the slanting side. The triangle is essentially a parallelogram cut in half. So logically, the formula is area equals half times the base times the height. Again, the height must be measured at right angles to the base. Some of the older textbooks refer to the height as the altitude of the triangle. Here's an example. The base is 6 centimetres, the height is 4 centimetres, so the area is half the base times the height equals 12 square centimetres. However, these triangles all have the same area. It's a strange thing. If you take two parallel lines and mark off a base and draw various triangles, they'll all have the same areas. <clears throat>